Hey everyone, this is Deanna. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm coming on and I want to show you what I picked up from the Happy Crafter Shop. And I want to share what I made, um, my traveler's notebook for Hawaii. So I know most of you have probably seen um, some of this stuff from the Happy Crafter Shop. But for those who haven't, I picked up this foam tape. It's black and it's adhesive double back foam tape and two in pink and i've not opened this up yet here's the information um if you want to take a snapshot it's the happy crafter shop and lisa is the owner and she is i got my package really fast so first off, oh, I got a free little gift. She always sends me, or in all packages, I believe, little furry gifts. These are so cute. They're little wooden love hearts. And I ordered two packs of this. If you can see it, it's sequins, heart sequins. Very pretty. I am obsessed with these shaker balls. If you have not used these in your shakers, they are amazing. So, I, yes, I did get more colors. So I got this red, the white, the pink, and the silver. And this teal. And this violet or purple I can't tell if this is navy I think this is blue and another purple so you could tell the difference in the purples so one's just a little bit deeper than the violet so I'm super excited to have these and I picked up <clears throat> these pink hearts they're beads and they say love and I picked up the um, mint colored ones that say love and I think that's it for that and I picked up these really cute heart beads they're pink and red these jelly belly I don't know what you call them they're like jelly beads they're pink and red, super cute. I love having that in my stash. Um, these clothes pins, and you can hang a really cute dangle from here or just put it on a project. So many ideas and options. And I picked up two packs of these. I thought they are super cute. They come in red and pink. They're beads. And I thought that this would be really cute, like on a beaded pin or a pokey tool. So I'm hoping that I can play around with that. I don't know how much Valentine's crafting I get to do, but I just wanted it for my stash. I picked up these hearts. These always come in handy for any project. It doesn't have to be Valentine's. I picked up a pack of these disco balls. And that's what they look like. They're red and pink. And I did get two packs of these resin hearts. And they are so cute. Let's see. I think... I think four you get five of each color the red and the pink but look at that isn't that gorgeous so I thought these would be really cute on bows or flowers or just some flip tags tag flips and then oh here's another free gift which is like an acrylic heart and it has a hole here for um, you could put a jump ring and it's mint colored. So I know she had some clear, 
acrylic things for sale, but I didn't, I'm not going to have the time to play with that, so I skipped right over that. And I picked up, looks like the bag busted open, the frosted red and white beads, and I picked up these gorgeous heart keys, and you can hang a dangle off of this heart and put a jump ring there or however you want to use it. And I did pick up a couple of these. I thought that this was super cute. Let's see, let's get a chin frame. But it's just a black checked um, chain that you can make your own dangle and then have this as the centerpiece. So I just thought that was super cute. I love black and white polka dots, checks, anything black and white, I, I love. And I did pick up a couple packs of the pink foam tabs. These are just the little squares. Um, I'm always using these little ones and I thought pink would be really cute, especially with spring, Valentine's, summer, crafting. And that's my haul for um, Lisa's The Happy Crafter Shop. I can't wait to play. I have an acrylic drawer that's really nice size. And I just <clears throat> keep all my Happy Crafter beads and supplies in it. And it, it's starting to fill up and it's so fun. The next thing is I... Am, I, if you've watched my videos, I'm heading to Hawaii tomorrow. Hopefully our plane doesn't get grounded like many, many planes are right now. But our son lives there and we're going to spend a late Christmas with them. And so if you follow Christian over at Christian's Crafty Adventures, she's always having fun projects and she loves traveler's notebooks and so i followed her tutorial and i bought the doodle bug i heart travel collection and it was kind of a last minute decision to do this <coughs> but i was inspired i want to put some beads on here this is the only elastic um stuff I had so I used pink but I love the airplanes and I haven't I was just it's really stormy here today and we're expecting some blizzard conditions in the mountains and I think that's going on pretty much everywhere so uh, today I'm just kind of hunkering down um, decorating this and doing my finished packing but this is just the start um, it has four signature pages I have never I've never made a signature page I've made little junk journals and stuff but this is my book so it's super cute so here's a pocket things to do and see, which we already have a huge list. I, um, at one time, two of my boys lived in Hawaii together for quite a while. So we've been to Hawaii um, several, several times and um, it's Oahu and we're mainly just going to hang out and we do have a sailing trip. Um, that we want to go on. Um, Captain Katie has a beautiful sailboat and we've gone out with her before and that's always a lot of fun. We're going to go on a snorkeling tour trip out of Colina. Um, my son works, has a manager at Tommy Bahama and so we want to go have a nice dinner there one night. And hopefully I can sneak down to that gift shop because um, they have just awesome stuff. And let's see. 
We want to go to the North Shore, Waimea Bay, Haleiwa. Um, just, we just have a few of our favorite things that we want to do. So, but I just wanted to show you. So I'm starting to decorate the little pages here. And I thought this will be, I can take notes about tomorrow, about our traveling experience. And <clears throat> so I just added a bunch of um, no, paper, white pages of computer paper, just regular computer paper. And then this, I thought I could list the different things that we're doing. And then here's the second signature. And it has a little pocket here. So I could put this in there and some more white paper and then here's the third signature which has a pocket here and a pocket here which i could add hmm i might have to go over here like i said i'm just getting into my <clears throat> decorating um i I've been super busy with just getting stuff done after Christmas. And then, let's see. Here's my fourth signature page. It has a big pocket here and lots of more white pages in here. And I have a sprocket, which is a little mini printer. And it prints out two by three sticker photos. And if you haven't seen it, the photos are amazing. It doesn't take ink. It just, um, <clears throat> just, it's their special little papers that they have. So I'm planning on bringing my sprocket so I can uh, work on it while I'm there. So that's my notebook. Thank you, Christian, for the great tutorial. I struggled with the signature um, elastic a little bit, but, um, her tutorial was for five and I only did four. So, um, but I think it still turned out really cute. <clears throat> I'm super excited to fill it up with all kinds of treasures from our trip. And I just wanted to share it with you all. So thank you for watching have a great day and if you haven't subscribed to my channel i hope you will and hopefully i can catch some great stuff in hawaii and and share it with you so have a great day catch you on the next crafty video bye